Hi, my name is Jamie from meetjamie.com and in this quick video, I wanna to talk to you for a few minutes about can you move from a Medicare Advantage plan back onto Original Medicare? Is it possible to go from a Medicare Advantage plan back to Original Medicare? I am an independent uh, Medicare advisor helping people navigate the Medicare program. And if you have questions, you can certainly reach out to me at 800-974-0552. So some people may be wondering if it's possible to go back on original Medicare once you have a Medicare Advantage plan in place. And what I want to share about that particular situation is this. First of all, everyone's Medicare enrollment is a little bit different because it's always based upon when you turn 65. So I can't give a concrete answer for everyone, but I can tell you, generally speaking, the options that you have when it comes to switching from Medicare Advantage back to original Medicare. There are a, a couple situations where you can do that if you're currently in a Medicare Advantage plan. The first and probably most likely time period that you would switch from a Medicare Advantage plan back onto Original Medicare would be the open enrollment period that happens every fall from October 15th through December 7th. That is the time period where most people shop and compare all of the Medicare plans available to them and usually will make a decision about switching from original Medicare to a Medicare Advantage plan, or perhaps a Medicare Advantage plan back onto original Medicare for the following year. The other time that a person may not know as much about is what's called the Medicare Advantage disenrollment period. That happens from January 1st through March 31st of every year. So if you have a Medicare Advantage plan and you want to go back onto Original Medicare, uh, onto Original Medicare, you can do that from January 1st through March 31st in most situations. Now, there's a couple things to keep in mind about the Medicare Advantage disenrollment period. And the first and most important thing is that if you have a Medicare Advantage plan that has prescription drug coverage on it, um, you'll want to look for a, a standalone prescription drug plan if you're gonna go back onto original Medicare. The second thing is, if you wanna have original Medicare in a supplement plan, and you're looking to do this during the Medicare Advantage disenrollment period from January through March, you have to bear in mind that a supplemental insurance company will require you most likely to answer health questions and go through medical underwriting. So the, you don't necessarily wanna just run out and disenroll from a Medicare Advantage plan because you can, because it may leave you exposed and you may have a gap in coverage. Um, the other time that you may be able to switch from a Medicare Advantage plan back to original Medicare is if you move out of the Medicare Advantage uh, um, service area. So if you live in one particular county and you have your Medicare Advantage plan there or one, in one state and you move out of that area and you lose that Medicare Advantage plan, this happens a lot of people move from one state to the other then you do have the option again to use original Medicare as your primary insurance. Um, again, each person's enrollment period is distinct and different. So the best thing to do would be to talk to a, a licensed uh, insurance agent about your particular situation. I'm happy to help with that if I can. Uh, you can reach me at 800-974-0552. The number's there at the bottom of the screen. Or you can also request information on our website and I'll leave a link to the in the description of this video to that website. If you have any other questions, feel free to let me know either via the comment um, or when we speak over the phone. Hope that's been helpful and we'll see you in the next one. 
Have a great day.